Imagine, if you will, a cosmic symphony composed of an unfathomable number of stars, their planets, and the smaller moons, all playing in harmonious synchronization. Yet there is a particular section of this orchestra that has confounded astronomers for centuries, exoplanets. These are not just any planets, but planets that exist outside our solar system, lurking in the depths of the Milky Way. Would it surprise you to know that among the cacophony of cosmic objects, there's one exoplanet that is so Earth-like, so tantalizingly similar, yet so enigmatic, that it might as well be Earth's celestial doppelganger. Hold your breath as we delve into the mind-bending realm of Proxima b, a mere 4.2 light-years away, and the James Webb Space Telescope, which is revolutionizing the quest to understand these celestial enigmas. Pause for a moment and let your imagination wander through the astronomical scope of our galaxy. It's been said that there are more than a quadrillion exoplanets, that's one with 15 zeros dancing behind it, residing in the far-flung corners of the Milky Way. To truly grasp the weight of that number, consider this metaphor. If each of these exoplanets were reduced to the size of a grain of sand, you wouldn't just fill the Grand Canyon. You'd have enough to create an entirely new geological feature on Earth's face. A Grand Canyon, 2.0 if you will, stretching miles upon miles. And that's not even counting the leftovers. And here's where it gets more astonishing. About 20% of these celestial bodies have been categorized as Earth-like in terms of their geological and atmospheric structure, a one in five chance of encountering a doppelganger of our home planet. The story doesn't stop there. Floating alongside these Earth-like planets could be another quadrillion moons, rocky satellites akin to our own lunar companion, ensnared in gravitational dances with their parent planets. So if you're placing bets on the odds of discovering another body in space that harbors life, or could potentially do so, the cosmic casino is teeming with high-stakes opportunities. Now that we've unfurled the canvas of cosmic scale, it's time to introduce the master artist equipped to paint intricate details on it. Meet the James Webb Space Telescope. Picture Sherlock Holmes in a celestial overcoat, magnifying glass replaced by a telescope lens that could put even the most advanced smartphone optics to shame. But we're not just talking about any lens here. James Webb Space Telescope boasts a 6.5 meter primary mirror, a full 2.7 times larger than Hubble's. Imagine the finesse it brings to the table. Being able to detect even the faintest flicker of a star billions of light years away, and then dissecting the intricate details of planets orbiting it. What makes the Webb Telescope revolutionary isn't merely its observational power, but its cutting-edge technology, including hypersensitive infrared sensors and advanced spectrographs. These tools can do more than just see. They can analyze. They can sift through the unique light signatures emitted or reflected by celestial objects to decode their atmospheric composition, density, and even mass. Think of it as space forensics. Could these planets have water, organic compounds, or even oxygen? JWST has the capability to answer these questions, elevating it from being a mere observer to an analytical genius. It's not just a step above its predecessor, the Hubble. It's more like a quantum leap. So if you found Hubble's discoveries mesmerizing, prepare yourself for a veritable feast of celestial revelations. Just as we've magnified our gaze into the intricate panorama of the cosmos, it's worth zooming in on a particular star of the celestial show, Proxima b. Ever since its discovery in 2016, this enigmatic planet has been akin to a Shakespearean protagonist, full of complexity and paradox, captivating astronomers and astrobiologists alike. So what's all the fuss about? To start with, Proxima b is practically within our cosmic suburb, situated just 4.2 light years away from Earth. To put that into perspective, if you could break the universal speed limit and travel at the speed of light, you'd arrive there in just over four years, roughly the same time it takes for your favorite TV show to jump the shark. No, God! Or a presidential term to elapse. But let's delve deeper into why this neighborly proximity is such a big deal. We're talking about a universe that stretches across an estimated 93 billion light years from end to end. So, stumbling upon a planet that's so tantalizingly close and yet holds so much promise for scientific investigation is not just like finding a needle in a haystack. 
It's like finding a diamond in a haystack the size of Mount Everest, a diamond that potentially holds the secrets to life itself. In the grand tapestry of the universe, Proxima B is an intricate stitch that begs for closer scrutiny, offering us invaluable clues that could redefine our understanding of habitability and life beyond Earth. It's not just Proxima B's proximity to Earth that sends ripples of excitement through the scientific community. It's the tantalizing hints that this planet is not just Earth-like, but possibly Earth 2.0. You see, Proxima B is comfortably ensconced in what astronomers term as the habitable zone, or the Goldilocks zone of its parent star. It's not too hot, and it's not too cold. It's just right for liquid water to exist. Imagine the possibilities. Cascading waterfalls, meandering rivers, expansive lakes, and perhaps even oceans as deep and mysterious as our Marianas Trench. But before you begin envisioning beach vacations on Proxima B, let's ground ourselves with some of its unique quirks. For starters, a single day on this intriguing exoplanet lasts a staggering 11 Earth days. Picture this, sunrises that don't just herald a new day, but unfurl slowly as if reluctant to give way to noon, and sunsets that stretch out languorously, casting prolonged golden hours that photographers dream about. It sounds poetic until you realize the biological implications. How would human biorhythms adapt to such protracted daylight and darkness? Would we need to eat three or four times the number of meals in a single Proxima B day? Would we even sleep the same way? Here, on this Earth-like yet bizarrely different planet, the fundamental patterns of life as we know it are both tantalizingly similar and perplexingly alien. It's as if nature is presenting us with a riddle wrapped in an enigma, testing the very limits of our understanding of what makes a planet habitable. You might be wondering, how do we even amass such precise and confident data about celestial realms that our feet have never tread upon? This is where the James Webb Space Telescope reveals its full prowess, unfolding its capabilities like a cosmic Swiss army knife. It's more than just a telescope. It's a multifaceted research lab hovering in the void of space, thanks to its groundbreaking technology. Astronomers don't just look at planets. They examine them through a prism of analytical approaches that would make even CSI labs look rudimentary. By deploying an array of advanced spectrographs, Webb can analyze the light signatures emanating from or bouncing off these remote planets. Each element or compound in a planet's atmosphere absorbs or emits light at a unique wavelength. By studying these patterns, scientists can essentially perform a remote biopsy of celestial bodies. They can pinpoint not just the atmospheric pressure and density, but also deduce the possible existence of life-sustaining compounds, such as water, organic carbon-based molecules, and even the life-affirming elixir of oxygen. This isn't just astronomy, it's astroforensics. We're not passively waiting for clues to float our way. We're actively hunting them down, probing into the very atoms and molecules that make up these enigmatic worlds. The James Webb Space Telescope isn't just an eye in the sky. It's a highly specialized lab analyst, a code breaker and a cosmic detective, all rolled into one. It takes our speculations and hypotheses about alien worlds and offers us a methodology to confirm or refute them. It's not merely advancing our view of the universe, it's revolutionizing our understanding of what could exist beyond our blue dot. Just when you thought we had unwrapped the most sensational layers of this cosmic onion, the story pivots, and suddenly we're faced with a plot twist straight out of a sci-fi thriller. Researchers using the James Webb Space Telescope captured something extraordinary from Proxima b, a signal so uncharacteristic that it sent shockwaves through the academic corridors and social media alike. Labeled as a techno-signature, this was an electromagnetic emission so complex and so anomalously patterned that it could potentially indicate the work of an advanced civilization. For an electrifying moment, the collective heartbeat of humanity seemed to pause, teetering on the cusp of a reality-altering revelation. Could this be it? Could this signal be the irrefutable proof that we are not alone in the universe? And then, as quickly as it had appeared, the signal vanished. No repeats, no follow-ups. It left behind not just a vacuum of silence, but a labyrinth of unanswered questions and burgeoning theories. Was this a transient cosmic hiccup, an accidental alignment of celestial energies? Or was it something more deliberate, 
a coded message, or even a cosmic SOS. The haunting specter of that solitary emission still looms large, casting a shadow of enigma over Proxima B and fueling heated debates and speculative fires. Was it merely an aberration or a tip-off to a cosmic narrative far more intricate than we could imagine? What do you think? The mystery endures, doesn't it? But wait, the narrative tapestry of our cosmic exploration isn't quite complete. The ink isn't dry. New chapters are still being written. This time, it's not just any group of scientists, but researchers from Harvard, no less, who are spearheading a paradigm shift in our quest for the extraterrestrial. They're not merely content with scrutinizing the natural signatures and phenomena we've been discussing. Oh no, they're dialing it up a notch, aiming to transform the James Webb Space Telescope into something like a cosmic night vision scope. Their plan? To seek out artificial light sources on both the dark and illuminated facets of these far-flung worlds. Consider the staggering implications. We're talking about the potential to spot the extraterrestrial versions of city skylines glowing in the darkness like luminescent pearls, or imagine seeing the radiant pulse of what could be an alien metropolis, humming with the cadence of advanced civilization and beaming its luminescence into the vast cosmic ocean. This would be evidence, not of just life, but of intelligent, technologically advanced life. It's a twist in methodology, aiming not just to discover life, but to stumble upon civilizations, societies perhaps even more complex than our own. Through the lens of the James Webb Space Telescope, we could be on the verge of peering into the illuminated windows of distant worlds, where beings possibly not so different from us discuss their dreams, hopes, and maybe even their theories about distant life in the cosmos. Can you grasp the monumental magnitude of such an endeavor? Do you feel the tremor of anticipation, the tingle of a reality yet to unfold? With cutting-edge tools like the James Webb Space Telescope, the question isn't if we'll find life beyond Earth, but when? What do you think we'll uncover next? I'd love to hear your thoughts. If this cosmic odyssey fascinated you, don't forget to hit that like button and share it with others who look up at the night sky and wonder. And if you haven't already, Click subscribe and ring that bell so you don't miss our next thrilling expedition into the unknown. For more mind-expanding content, click the video on your screen now. Until next time, keep looking up, because the universe is full of stories waiting to be told.